Hi, it's Lasse here. Uh, today is Thursday. <laughs> it's our third workshop. Uh, we are doing workshops about Web 2.0 and Travel 2.0. And uh, in total, we have done five already in this region of Asturias that you can see in the background. And today uh, we had a really interesting uh, seminar and workshop with Jimmy Pons. Jimmy, are you tired or? I'm are exhausted. You... <laughs> because yeah. after three days of uh, doing these workshops, like eight hours a day non-stop. Well, after three, you are it's, tired. Yeah, we are a little. But bit it's tired. really but happy, happy, very happy with the people. Yes, and we were talking here before that everybody thinks that internet is really difficult and. Web 2.0, it's really difficult for small businesses and they think it's confusing, but after we show them, they they get excited. Yeah, and well, it's it's quite funny because, you know, when you see it from outside, they think that it's really complicated. Uh, they think that you'd have to be a real uh, person who have been studying many years for that, but because these people is not young people, it's people who is for first time looking and uh, try to do something different yeah and of course in this type of moment that we there is a lot of crisis they are looking for th things to do in a very cheap way and the cheap way today is using internet and spending time no money yeah so that's why when we show them how easy it is they say ah, I thought it was more uh, complicated you know the problem is to know how you do it Yes. And that's what we teach them. In the morning we do the theory and then in the afternoon we do the practice and we show them how you uh, can create a video channel, how you can upload v uh, photos, how you can do a blog and things like that and how they can start to do things. And especially in tourism it's important to use internet because you can upload videos, you can upload pictures. So it's important to communicate the the benefits that your destination or your hotel has and like here we can see the background is uh, nice forest and mountains and so on so it's much more important to use internet and web 2.0 in tourism than in in other industries would you well of course when you want to show something a hotel a destination which is the better way to show it it's a video yeah and maybe 10 years ago it was impossible for a little hotel to put, not impossible, but very expensive, to put a video in a website and also the people who had good connection to see the video probably was very few. Exactly. But now everybody can have a, a YouTube channel and, and put videos uh, there. Exactly, and we have to say thanks for the organization who has organized these seminars, which is the regional organization, or how would you say it in in it's the Principado de Asturias, Principado and, de Asturias. And ICTE, which is an institute who uh, tries to bring, who brings the quality to the tourism different business. tourist business here in, in, in Spain, which I have to say they are doing a great job here in Asturias. They, 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 are, they have very clear that, you know, the thing is, first of all, you have to have to have a good product. If you don't have a good product, it doesn't matter if you put a video in YouTube or not. Yeah. So first of all, you have to have a good product and also uh, quality in this product. Exactly. And we can say that in, in Spain, in many of these things, Spain is one of the leaders in Europe. And maybe Principado de Asturias could be like a reference of Europe of how uh, to use quality I, with... I would say yes. I would say yes, they, they do a great job. Great job. And also your organization is institution of hotel, uh, institution of technology. <coughs> and you give uh, teachings and workshops for hotels, how they can use technology and internet and, and so on. Right. Uh, innovation. Innovation is the key, right? Yes. Innovation exactly. is the key for the future. Exactly. And let's let's end the video while talking something about Asturias and these uh, nice views, although we have one house there which is not that nice. but. But what, what would you recommend for somebody who comes here? The food is good and people are nice. And well, I, I, uh, are nice. I am surprised of the landscape. Yes. How green it is, the mountains, the, the forest, everything. Uh, you, you can see not far away from the, except of this car who is <laughs> passing by now. Uh, I, I think there is a country where you have 
in between 20 minutes you have to you can be in on the beach up to the mountains with yeah. the snow and then in 20 minutes you go down 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 and you can see you can be on the beach and for the little region of Spain it's plenty to see exactly exactly so, so it's that's uh, for me the amazing thing of uh, this country here it's it's really good Asturias. and and with that we will end this uh, video and to say that we'll now go to taste uh, Asturian cider right right citra cider is the cider place. yes excellent thank you let's go